How's it going guys? Justin Selman here from Top Line Hockey. Super excited to be trying out the Slingshot Passer from Bauer. Got a variety of drills we're gonna work through today. Short range, long range, we're gonna get some shots in, some rebound training, work on our hands, hand speed, catching passes. Uh, we're gonna mix it all in here. So we got the short, we got the long, we got both of them on the ice with us today. Gonna test these both out. Let's see how it goes. All right, I'm here with my guy, Colin. So Colin's gonna pass himself a puck off the pad. Boom, right here, he's a righty, so he gets his hands out, underhandles this puck, receives it, shot comes here. I pass the puck off the slingshot at the bottom, he finds the rebound, puts it under the bar. Hey, the quicker you get it off, the more time you'll have for the second one too, right? So as soon as you get that off, it's coming. There you go, beast. For this one, we have three of the slingshot passers, one of the smaller ones, two of the larger ones on the ends. This is a reaction drill. You can do it on the ice or synthetic. Uh, we're gonna have the player right in here facing the bumper. So you're gonna be right here. Pucks are gonna come from the coach through his skates. He's gonna react. If I say one, it's a quick touch to his forehand side, catch and release, no stick handle. Two would be a backhand pass, backhand catch, quick release. If I say shoot, as soon as it comes off this pad, I want you to handle it, no stick handle, as soon as you can, get the shot off. Okay, so it's gonna be kind of rapid fire, pucks are gonna come pretty quick. You'll get a hang of it here, all right? Ready, boss? One, two. Two, two shot. Quick shot. Good, let's reset that one. Now you're getting it, yeah? Hands off your body. Get around these pucks. Make the puck do the work. You get around these pucks. Ready? One. One, two. One, two shot. Quick shot. All right, Petey. One, two. If I say quick shoot, just catch and shoot. Two. Two, two, one. One, two, one. Quick shot. Atta boy, I got nothing left. We're gonna go through a drill. You could do it two ways. If you have a coach with you, he can make this initial pass for you. And then you'll need someone to make the second rebound if you have two of these pads with you. But we're gonna work on putting this pad, puck off the pad. As soon as we collect this puck, I'm a lefty, so I'm gonna head fake out to my right, roll around. As soon as I make this crossover, I'm gonna let that shot go. He's opposite, he's a righty, so kind of simulating tracking pucks in your feet, especially in the slot, pucks kick out off a rebound. So you're gonna come here, right? You're a righty, so you're gonna go here, head fake. As soon as you cross over, line this shot up, let it go, and my pass is coming off the rebounder down there. Right, as soon as you find it, you're already collecting it, as little stick handles as possible, puck comes through. Find it, quick, turn, step. See ya. Should we run through it? There you go. Quick roll off, head fake. Good little head fakes. Got it, find it, pull it to the backhand. Get it up there. Really excited to be adding these Bauer slingshot passers to our toolbox. Uh, a lot of great uses for these. You can work on your reaction speed, catching and receiving passes, you know, working by yourself if you're not having a coach on the ice with you, working on catching pucks on your back end, simulating a rebound scenario. Uh, a lot of ways you can pass and receive pucks. Really heavy, really durable. So, you know, you hop on the ice for a skill session, you know you're not gonna be moving them around as a coach, that's super important for me. Really big sweet spot, really doesn't matter where you hit these things, puck's coming off even every time. You know, on the glyce, I think you can get a lot of use out of this. On the ice, it's not sliding at all. Put it in front of the net there, simulate a rebound, game-like scenario. So, a ton of use for these. Uh, we're gonna be using them a ton at top line. 